Say Sivakasi and chances are the first word that springs to mind is crackers. This dusty town in southern Tamil Nadu makes over 90% of the country's fireworks. For nearly 8 lakh people employed by the little over 1,000 factories here, the calendar revolves around a single festival, Diwali. It's been that way since the 1920s when two brothers decided to make Sivakasi the hub of pattas or cracker making. But the future is uncertain because of the big dampener posed by the Supreme Court's latest verdict. 23rd uh, October, uh, our Honorable Supreme Court, uh, they uh, give a judgment. We have to make only green crackers and less emittent crackers. Okay, it's good. Uh, but uh, we don't know what is green crackers. Okay, uh, If we have a definition for that one, surely we will make a... Whatever the Supreme Court is uh, suggesting. Green crackers are clear cut. We have to say that the government is ready to do it. We have to do it. Suppose the government is ready to do it. We have 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 to do it. ग्रीन पाटा का भी बनकर तैयारी नहीं हुआ तो आएगा कहाँ से? इसे दुकानों पर ताले लगे हुए। जब हमारे घर में दीवे कौन लाएगा, मिठाइयाँ कौन लाएगा, बच्चों के कपड़े कौन लाएगा? मेरा रिटेल का काम है। मात्र दस दिन का होता है, और मात्र दस दिन पहले ही बंद कर दिया जाए, मतलब रोजी रोटी से भी बंद so far, the Petroleum and Explosive Safety Organization that comes under the Union Ministry of Commerce and Industry has the final say on the chemical composition of all the fireworks that are made. After uh, deriving the new formula and all, uh, the government will suggest with the help of CSIR, uh, then only we can uh, start our uh, production. Uh, it will take, uh, we don't know the time uh, duration. Uh, within two months or six months or six years. Sivakasi has its own fireworks research and development centre that was established in 2011. Since then, the FRDC addresses the requirements of the fireworks industry from testing of raw materials to the manufacturing processes to the safety of each of these factory workers to designing environmental friendly crackers. But to go fully green, these factory owners will have to incur more costs. And that's going to be tough. Turnover dropped by 50% last year because of the ban on crackers in the Delhi NCR region that accounts for about a fourth of the industry's revenues. This year, factories have already been shut for nearly 50 days. In this labour-intensive industry, the brunt will be borne by the workers. Farming is not an option because of Sivakasi's history of water scarcity and drought. We are not doing this. This is not a job. 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 Or we are a tolil park or another in the other than other tolil park. Passangla particular care, a lot of bugger stop. But would I let two rendmas on the Valani Paditang? Any Paditang, Passangla Park, the Passangla Chapa, the Guruka Mura, the Plaka Stop. People continue to work at these factories despite the serious occupational hazards. The Patanala Catholic was what a program the Amatro Kanaka. My love over the Panati Almanato. Mother, 
பேராசில் வேலை பார்க்குறோம் வருமானத்துக்கு அளவுக்கு தகுந்து சம்பாதிக்க முடியல குடும்பங்கள் அதிகமாகிடுச்சு The industry estimates a loss of 600 crore rupees this year. The livelihood of Abu Ahim and many others like him may be in jeopardy. Their right to livelihood in direct conflict with society's right to better air and quality of life. Happiness this Diwali will mean different things to different people.